Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Sassy Hilda and I'm glad to be here again because I'm going to be making a new kind of tutorial and this one is really special for me because I'm going to be decorating my home, my walls because I moved a new apartment and my walls are empty and I want to make them look beautiful. And today I'm going to be making an inspired sunburst mirror which i'll be putting on the wall and i would like you to stay tuned but before i get into this tutorial if you haven't subscribed to my channel welcome to the squad go ahead and click on the red button and you're subscribed and thanks for those who have subscribed to my channel already i'm so grateful that you've been following me and i'm so glad that i'm inspiring you but anyway thank you so much i don't want to talk too much because i want to hit into this tutorial and give you the best mirrors i hope you enjoyed this tutorial stay tuned and enjoy it here are all the items we're going to be using. I'm going to be using the plywood. Some people use cotton, but I prefer to use the plywood. And I'm going to be using a mirror as well. I've made a round circle in the middle of the wood. And this is a, a sign that I put an act to show that this is where the middle of the, of the wood is. So the mirror is going to lay here, right here in the middle. I'm going to be needing a scissors, a glue gun, and a glue stick. I'm going to be needing a special um, glue for the mirror. I'll use this to glue the mirror onto the, the wood. And then the special thing that is going to make this sunburst mirror look special will be a spoon. It's a disposable spoon. I've cut it into um, the shape I want it to be. So all you just need to do is take a spoon How to get this how to get this shape of spoon all you need to do is just um, take a spoon and the scissors and then you cut off this part and it gives you this this is what you need for the decoration so everything will lay like this just by the mirror everything I'll put all over the mirror and I will start decorating I'm gonna take the mirror I place it in the middle just to make an exact position where I want it to be and it will be a sample for me to lay the spoons so I'll have an exact calculation of how the spoons would go around the, the mirror so I'll take the first spoon I'll take the first spoon probably might just need to turn this around just in case it falls on it Finished with the second round. Now I'm going to go into the third round. In between these two spoons, I'm going to place the third one. But I'll push it a little bit forward.
so here I've done um, like six circles with the smooth spoon I had before and now what I thought about is trying to use another set of spoon this is a bigger spoon compared to the one I used before this is the first one this is the first one I used and this is the second one and it's a little bit the new one is a little bit bigger than the old one so my intention is to make this part look like let's say the wider it is the bigger the spoon and this is something I want to do to make it look a little bit different I don't want everything to look like the same like all these place are the same I want this side to be of another size so I'm gonna start putting the, the spoons on the wood So now we have a beautiful sunburst mirror and it's looking really good. I'm going to take it out to spray it. So now I'm going to be spraying the spoon sunburn with a bright copper spray. I got the spray from Amazon so I'll just go ahead and start spraying it. But before I start I need to shake it very well for about some minutes. now it's time to glue the mirror to the wood and here is the glue i showed you earlier that i'll be using so i'll just turn the mirror the other way around and um open up the product i will first of all start placing the the glue making sure it goes round so the mirror can stick to the wood 
and then I'm going to place the mirror on top of it. So now that I've finished, I'm going to install a hook behind the mirror so it could stay on the wall. I'm going to be making a kind of a series of mirrors and decorations for my home and I'll be posting everything for you guys to see. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you all for watching. Thank you so much. See you on my next video. Bye.